Yo, what is up guys, Zorin here with another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet VGC video. Hope everyone's doing well. Now today we are bringing you a Kyogre team with a Toxic Croak and Salamence. And Thunderous. <laughs> Three things that we don't really see, but mainly the Toxic Croak because we don't really see Toxic Croak. This one's running Assault Vest and the whole idea is that you, you, you put it next to the Kyogre and just start Surf spamming. Because you can do that, you can just Surf. Since Surf usually hits the... Your, the your 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 pat partner on top of the the enemy, it um usually is something that you don't want to put out with Kyogre, but because thankfully Toxicroak has dry skin, you actually absorb the um water water type moves and heal off it while also being weak to fire. But thank thank thankfully you have the drizzle to kind of like negate that as well. So you kind of like neutral to fire again thanks to the drizzle. You do have Thunderous here for some air impulse shenanigans and some Wild Board Stone Thunder Wave and Rain Dance stuff. We've got Salamence here with for our Tailwind with Rocky Helmet support and the Intimidate. We also have Incineroar for Intimidate because we want to be, you know, rotating the Intimidates. And you've got Amoongus here for some support action. All right, so that's gonna be the team. We're gonna see if Toxic Crow can do anything in this restriction on this restriction meta, and we'll see what it can do. If you guys want to try out the team, then the rental and the team base will be in the description below. And as always guys make sure to like and subscribe if you guys aren't already subscribed please make sure you are because if you guys aren't already watching you might as well just subscribe all right with that said let's just get straight into it and see what this team can do all right well they have white guard they indeed have white guard um that means i can't well i could still bring it but i can't go for a site in here we only have stride moves they have white guard Like Toxic Crook looks really good here though. It's just that they have white guard. Do we just like check this real quick? Um I'm trying to figure out what we, what do we do here? They also can take away my weather because of Terrapa Ghosts. They 100% need to go there. What do we what do we want to bring then? They have a crop ba ba ma 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 ba too. Hmm. And figure out what's the best outcome here. Yes, these four is fine. These four look fine, I think. I think. If they don't bring that power trip dude in the back, I swear to god. Or in the front. I could've just went Kyogre. Yep, there it is, okay. There it is. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even sure, I'm just gonna go straight for this thing. I'm going straight for this thing. He might protect. That's, that's, that's kind of like my reasoning here. He might not know what Toxic Rook does, I guess, and then doesn't even go for a protect, but I'm still going for this. If we can get rid of the white guard, we'll be, we'll, we'll good. Yeah, there's the protect. Oh, he's double protect too. Nope, nope, double protect. Okay, cool. This thing doesn't have any any special defense if I remember correctly. What the heck? Oh, okay. Well, you should have made that a special berry because that's what you needed. You needed a special berry. Yeah, that's what you need. A special berry. Okay, so Toxic Rook is faster than Salamence here, which is interesting to note. But there goes their Wide Guard, which is step number one. Now, step number two is getting rid of this ugly turtle in the front, in, in our front. Okay. Let's 
So here's the thing. We got Incineroar in the back. I think we'd still go into Ky Kyogre here. Yeah. I think we double switch here. We didn't put up Tailwind, but that's okay. This thing has to be clear amulet, right? Oh, it's not. Life Orb, maybe? Most of them are Life Orb or Clear Amulet, so that's what I'm assuming. It wasn't Speed Booster. I didn't see any Speed Booster, right? No. Unless I just missed it. Imprison? Okay. Not sure what that does, but okay. Uh, hmm. I might just knock this off. No, I need a parting shot this. I'm just gonna water spout. I know this is rough, but it is kind of rough. But we'll see. Yeah, I'm just gonna parting shot. Could have gone for fake out too, but he might protect again. That was deep blade. That's nothing, which is fine. There's Terra Star Storm, that's not gonna KO me though. Oh. Okay. Well. Okay. Being times four weak to this though is kind of rough. Can we even afford a Tailwind? One twenty one speed. I don't know. I did go for it. Actually, I played this wrong. I played this turn really wrong. I played it wrong. Oh. Okay. Does it just not have Psyblade? I'm gonna laugh if it doesn't. Oh, that there's nothing. Oh, it's citrus berry. I kind of want to go into Incin right now and protect. I need to get rid of this this <laughs> this thing. That's what I need to do. And it, it hasn't revealed Psyblade. That's the thing, which is something that I need to I need to make sure it doesn't have. 
It's Ally Switch and Leaf Blade. No Side Blade? It might not have it because it's on the Terrapagos team. I just want to make sure. Because if, if it doesn't have it, then yeah, I, I kind of just... I should be fine on Toxicroak. I think even at minus two, I go down to it. Even minus three, I might go down to a side blade. Okay. Well, that works. Close combat. This thing does not have side blade. At least I'm hoping it doesn't. With the way it's been playing, it doesn't have it then. Okay, I mean... I'm just gonna Ice Beam this. I didn't even realize this thing had Eject Button, the, the Incineroar. I just kind of looked at Incineroar and thought it was just Incineroar. And yeah, there goes that. Oh. Thor just took it. Okay. Okay, Incineroar. This thing doesn't have no, vote, no attack investment. Oh my god. Well, wow, this this is a, probably the worst um, Iron Leaves I've ever seen in my life. I did nothing. It absolutely did nothing. Okay, now Snorfalker is out. Who's this? Oh, this thing. Okay. I mean, I don't get any hits off here. Right? So I, I'm just gonna go for knockoff and I'm just gonna go for protect. Toxic Crook should just finish off this thing then. And honestly, it probably does. I could probably just go in into Salamence. Tailwind up. I'm trying to figure out what do I do here? I can't let I can't let my dude go down, that's why. Yeah, there's still a star storm. I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna how I'm gonna approach this. Yeah, that's Ice Hammer. I think we go into Toxic Rogue next for sure. That's Leftovers too, okay. I'm gonna fit this out. I'm just gonna go for Surf. Uh, I have a bit of a problem here. Yeah. Let's try this. I'm gonna fake out, do this, see if maybe I can get my Tailwind up. Might work out for me here, I'm not sure. He didn't protect. So yeah, we're gonna take this really badly right now. Okay. Not as bad as I thought we would take it. Okay. Well, I need to go for Drain Punch here. I'm just going to go for Tailwind.
I really hope I'm faster than this thing. Because if we're slower, we, we kind of lose. Like, we need to hope this to wrap because it's slow, slow. I haven't even really looked at speed tiers for that right now. And Salamence is slower than Toxic Rock, so if, if, if it's slower than Toxic Rock, that means I am. Um, I'm a pretty slow Salamence. That's something to note here. There are very slow Salamence if that's the case. Uh, that, that, did, that did absolutely nothing, okay. We do get the Tailwind off though, which is nice. Kinda needed. Oh, we're, we're losing both our monsters though, aren't we? Yeah, we lose both our monsters, I think. So either way, we couldn't do anything. Yeah, we got Ice Hammered here. Oh, okay. So I think we just lose. I think we just lose then. What could I have done then? What could I have done? Um, not switch out. That's that's it. So like we could protect this. Yeah, uh, it has white guard too. Okay. Well, they both have white guard. It had. There's two white guard users on this team. Two of them. There was two. Oh, okay. Well, then we just lose flat out. Salamence was not the play at all. Then. Salamence was indeed not the play to bring. Because he also had white guard. Okay. Well, it was a close one, I guess. Not really. It was not close. If he had, he had if he had double white guard, then I basically couldn't win. All right. Well, GG. Okay. Well, we'll see if this goes better for us. I'm not sure if it will, but we'll try. I realize how how reliant we are on this Kyogre with this team. We have like no damage, like no reliable damage in in this in this in this meta. And if that's wide guard, we got we, we can't do anything if that's wide guard. Yeah, if it's wide guard, we get we're just we're just kind of cooked. On the uh, on the Lunala, um, they have an Indeedy as well, so that's expanding force. Do we have wide guard? No, we don't have wide guard. Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. It's been rough these past two videos, man. There's like no damage in this one, though. Yeah. Well, Toxic Croak does nothing for me here. That's the thing. I'm just gonna go for water spell, switch out to incineroar. If it has wide guard, it has wide guard. Like what what else can we do? If it has wide guard, it has wide guard. That's follow me, that means no wide guard. Okay, cool. That's what we wanna see. That means there's no wide guard. Oh, it's fat. It's it's scarfed. Either it's scarfed, or we have the slowest. We have the slowest dude in the world right now. That is that is basically what I'm seeing here. We either it's either scarfed or our Kyogre is too slow. I don't think Lunala is faster than Kyogre. No, it's not.
Well... Well, what do we do? Did he really just give me that? No, he has to. He, he's meteor beaming me, isn't he? No, he can't meteor beam. He's scarfed, right? Brother, your Kyogre's slower than Lunala. You're joking. Brother, your your Kyogre is slower than a. M I don't know what to do anymore, man. We can't sucker punch. We can't do anything. No. Bro, we can't do anything. We're slower than Lunala. We're naturally slower than Lunala. Bro. Holy. I am getting just non stop surprises with this team. We don't have any way to terrain control on this team. We have nothing. <laughs> we just get. We just get absolutely crushed with the, in these videos right now. He's plus one, so now my career can go down to this. And that's only his first Pokemon, too. We still have three, three more Pokemon to go through, and I can't even do damage to this thing. It's not floating. It's not floating. It's in... Yeah... We're so worth it. We're slower than we're, than it. Oh my god, that is so sad. We absolutely can't do anything here. It, it's gonna have Moongai Bleed too. It has to have it. Jesus Christ, this Toxic Croak is garbage! <laughs> it does nothing! <laughs> its damage is so bad, like you, you rely so much on this Kyogre, man. Oh. Oh, that's huge. That's actually a big survival. Hold on, we might just be back. Hold on, we might just be back. Because I, I don't know how else we're going to be back. I can tell you that much. I don't know how else we're going to come back. Oh, don't tell me you're Dark Type too. It's poison. Okay, I can, I can deal with that. Kind of. All right. We can't even do that, right? I forgot about that. And that KOs, yeah, Toxic Croak, you you do nothing. Oh no. Oh no, you don't do anything. I kinda forgot about the ear impulse thing too. But I mean at this point it doesn't really matter. Kyogre being slower than Lunala of all things, the thing that usually runs Trick Room. 
was all that we needed to to lose this. We tried to survive long enough for the terrain too, but it wasn't gonna be enough. When with no protects, barely any protects on this on this on the things that matter. There's nothing we can do. Like that's that's just the gist of it. The only thing I can think of is if I went for ear impulse on the on the Lando instead. That might have been my only play then. That might have been my only play. Cause then, it, then at least Toxic Crook would have lived, I think. Yeah, that was that would be my only play, huh? Ah, I think that was my only out. Oh well, second loss with this Toxic Crook. Well, okay, uh, can we get one win? That'd be great. One win would be fantastic here. But right now, it's not looking good. Not looking good at all. It really isn't. These two don't look too bad here, but at the same time, it's like if they go Chen Pao Rayquaza right off the bat, I think I'm, a, I'm in a little bit of trouble. If they, if they have water, they have water bone and water bone just kind of like sits there and destroys me for free. Otherwise, forces me to Terra. And we're really slow. This team is actually really slow and kind of really needs Tailwind. But it's Tailwind's user. It's Dragon type. Whimsicott, Chen Pao, Buttermain. They all they all take take care of it pretty easily. Yeah, I don't know. i I'm, I'm having really bad bad luck with these teams these past two videos. I won't lie. And I don't. It takes it takes a while for these battles too. It's not like I can just keep looking for battles to showcase what these mons can do. It's already 1 a.m. for me right now, and I started at 12:30. So you can see how long it takes just to do this. This is actually the best case scenario for me here. I'm just gonna thunder wave. That's fine. Just thunder wave this thing. That's fine. We're just gonna go for the same thing, I guess. Because Ogre Punk can't do anything to uh, what's his face, right? Okay, so he's just risk. He's just gonna get rid of it. Okay, he's going for Sword Dance then. He's just gonna give. He's just gonna give it up then. I just have to not miss Gunk Shot. Okay, good. Okay, nice. We get the one shot on it, which is nice. The only thing is, how do we deal with this thing and uh, this ugly thing, right? Yeah, because it's Sword Dancing. How do we deal with this? It's not the question, because here's Shen Pao. Yeah, how do we deal with this? Oh boy. Yeah, how do we uh, how do we deal with this? Yeah, it's clear amulet plus two. 
probably just get Rayquaza out here now. I don't see how we get out of this. We have no way to like stop extreme speeds. That's the thing. We have no way to stop extreme speeds. It's terror normal, but you, you, you're you gonna think, oh, well now you can just do that. No, it can't. Oh, I just protected, wow. It really did protect. Oh, I went straight for, oh no, it's Incineroar, yeah. Oh, eject button is so, so bad here. That's really bad here. I actually don't know what to do here because we don't really have the power for it. Like I said, Kyogre is really our only damage. So we don't really have much offensive threat in this team. It's really easy to set up on this team too. Yeah, goodbye. You just need to live a, a hit, I guess, here. At least it's not Icicle Crash. Okay, that's good damage. Thought we might have an out, maybe. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna protect here. I know my I know my thing that my 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 rain basically doesn't do anything here because of the weather the the weather lock thing. Now let's protect. I'm protecting too. There goes our ice spinner. Okay. We might actually have a, a chance here now. Because that protect is actually really big for us. Because I can now fake that. Fake fake out that slot. And just go for a, a surf. We can finally do the surf thing. It only took three battles. But we finally got the surf thing going. Yeah, we we got we finally got the surf thing going. Okay, well, can we win this one then? Because if we we get rid of, we get rid of Rayquaza, I think we're we'll be fine. Because like I said, we we're really relying on this uh on this Kyogre. We have like no real like physical threat. Yeah, like he had to really think about that. But he can't he can't extreme speed. He thinks I'm going for. I don't even know why he did that. Oh, I guess it's because he doesn't have any other anything else to go for. But yeah, my only my only play here is to do this. Healing up the Toxic Croak as well, which is nice because we know Ice Spinner can't do anything. Sucker Punch can't hurt me. Sacred Sword can't hurt me. So yeah, like Chen Pao can't do anything. This is why I didn't want to go for it. And I was also kind of helping Toxic Croak deal damage to the Rayquaza, right? Okay. Here's where the fun begins. Alright, we're just gonna sucker punch this side and I'm just gonna go for another surf. Yeah. Yeah, like that's not gonna do a lot. We're we're sold this, so I, I'm I'm having high hopes that we're gonna do something here. That we could take this moonblast, right? Yeah, we could take it. We're a sold this, right? 
that's like the whole thing here. We're actually able to showcase why why you could do why the surf team can work with the with the toxic croak, and that pretty much just finishes it off. Oh my god, if he didn't protect where he did, we probably would have lost. If he, I don't know why he protected either. Was there a reason to? Oh yeah, it was because of the the incineral, right? Because it was it was inside. But at the same time, it's like I'll take it. You know, we needed we, we needed exactly that. We needed the protect. The protect went going off. Helped me uh, get that in. All right, well, GG. Okay, well, that's gonna be the end of the video. At least we got a win at the end there. I'll take it. Uh, we we actually got to do the the whole toxic Kyogre thing as well, so that's that was kind of like the whole the whole thing. Other than that, it it didn't really do much. Like it, it, we couldn't we couldn't really make it work. We tried to like really really set it up, and it still couldn't do anything for us. So it's 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 not the best. It's not the best, especially because it didn't have we didn't have a way to like really do damage with this thing. I think I think there's just too much support on this team. There's just way too much support that we couldn't do anything about it. Because it's still, it, it, at the end of the day, it's still a Kyogre team. It's not really a Toxic Crow Kyogre team. It's more like Kyogre and friends because uh, Kyogre kind of needs like all the support it can get. I think like Amoongus and Cinnaro were actually more useful here than anything else, which is, I guess, expected because they're the most meta. They're the meta mons. Also, the the eject button, the eject button thing was kind of like rough for me too. But I I I see why you want the eject button. It's because you have fake out. Incineroar, and then you can fake out into Toxicroak, switch in, fake out again, cap Kyogre. So you know, I see, I see what you gotta do. We just ran into a lot of White Guard and White Guard potential, and then we ran into faster Lunala than this Kyogre. So yeah, the last two, the last two uh, videos had me just getting outsped, which is hilarious. Oh well. With that said, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.